what's a great way to get out with your family, especially in weather like this in East Texas? We go geocaching. Come along and join us on our adventure today. Rolling down the road. Hey, what are you doing? We gotta go by Sonic first. We gotta get our drink. Alright y'all, we went to Sonic at happy hour, now we're happy, happy, happy! We got french fries, blue raspberry nerd slush, we got an ocean water, Dr. Pepper, <laughs> and coke, yep, it's cheat day today! We're so glad you're with us! I'm just going to show you what the app looks like on your telephone so you could uh, use it if you decide you want to go geocaching one day. Uh, first I suggest you go to geocache.com and set up a login before you get started and then link your phone to your uh, profile there on geocache.com. So it's right there that C G E O. So okay, it's C G E O. There are several apps that you can do. This is just our preferred one that we've noticed seems to work best. And you just open it up, hit live map, wait for it. See all those green. And yellow and red circles, those are geocaches nearby. Now we used to geocache with just the GPS, which was a lot of fun, but these smartphones have opened it up so you can really cheat. So there's one coming up. So you just click on it gives you the information if you want to go and do it with your GPS you just go to more details and they'll give you the coordinates and whatnot um, if not you can just go up into this corner on the three dots driving and it opens up your map app to direct you right to it. All right so I've handed it over to daddy because he was a Royal Rangers leader and he knows how to use a compass and well I don't. We are at Malden Memorial Garden. It's a small country cemetery. It said we didn't have to go in it. Oh, he's looking in pipes. It is a macro. Oh, he found it already. Oh, we don't have a pen. Our geocache. We found it and they don't want to touch it. This is what you would call a micro. Use the compass. It works fantastic. A micro geocache. So this is one that you would probably just sign and log in and then you put it back. I'll go get a pen. It's in the fence post. You have in to pull the fence it out. post. I'll go get a pen. <coughs> you don't take all the... In a small cemetery aside the road. Not very many people buried here, but you never know where you're going to get a geocache. So you take it out and you what? sign your name. You sign your name. In oh, other okay. cases, you would switch out items, but this is a micro. Do we say all our names? So we're waiting for Abigail to get a pen. She's back at the vehicle. Are we all gonna say write our names? We will write the Abbott family.
So when you do these, you got to make sure you have a writing utensil. Sometimes they supply it and sometimes they don't. Good job, Daddy. He and Colton are always the finders. And you roll it up the way it was. It does look like a glue stick. And you put it back the way you found it. You also uh, need to be sure there's other people called letterboxers. So if there's a stamp in there, in a geocache or nearby, that is a completely different thing. Do not take the stamp. And you just put it right back. All right, Damn. off to our next adventure. Bye. All right, Daddy's out there with his navigational compass using skills. He goes in the long grass. Abigail asked, can I video? So we're going to pass it on. Be prepared to get seasick. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, you have flip flops on. Are you gonna go in there? You gonna cry if you get another sticker? Do you wanna go? Okay. Let's go. Alright, let's go. I'm gonna try making it. Oh wait, that's true. I'm looking for stickers at the beginning. I'm making sure there's no poison ivy. That's what? what I was gonna say. Can that's I for your snakes. I've got a pen. Oh, great. I'm not going in that. Oh, and Lila's back there waiting. I guess we'll all go back there waiting. We'll see what he brings back. Lila decided not to go back. It got pretty thick back there anyway, so... We'll just come here. Good old country road. You want to go up there? Don't you think we should watch Daddy and make sure he's safe? Dad, it said it went this way, though. He's got the compass. He knows what he's doing. Is the car still on lock? I do not have my keys. My keys are in the car. And this is what kids do when they're bored already waiting for the geocache to come because they're not about to get out in that long grassy area. What you trying to hit? I see that pole. Which one? There's lots the of poles. One. The first one? Go ahead. Miss. Yeah, like by an inch. Oh, I got a shell. Oh, that's We're not by the ocean. It ain't a shell. Oh! Booyah! She's the pole hitting queen. I hit it. I hit it. You hit it. Do the hit it dance. <laughs> How'd that go again? <laughs> boom, chicka, boom. He's I made a mark. <laughs> still searching. Okay. He's one to never okay. give up. Okay. He's also the one that always goes in the thick uh, bushes. Yep. He's oh, also the one who is off. extremely allergic to poison ivy. I would go in there if I had pants on. We may commit this one to defeat. We shall see. Okay, so the geocache says that it's in a cemetery and as you can see 
There is no cemetery. Up here. So most likely, it might be we are in the wrong spot. But it says the geocache is up there. Now, Lila did find some treasures. I'm not exactly sure I want any of them. <laughs> There's some <laughs> makeup. Makeup, a baby nose cleaner. Make glass. Barbecue. But I don't Beep. see any headstones. I don't see any headstones. We might have to go check and see if. No, it's not. It's that way. It's that way? There might be a road further down there that we can actually drive to instead of walk. Maybe. I'm thinking we turned too soon. What do you think, Daddy? I have no idea. I found some weird ones in the middle of nowhere, so it could be anywhere. Well, let's let's load up and let's go. There's a sign over yeah, here. That's the lease, lease sign. That's the lease oil sign. lease sign. We are in oil filled country. Let's go load up in the car no and go see if we just the missed the road. Right in the I'm middle not. of that puddle. I dig for that. I think it's I'm in that puddle right there. Going go ahead, Amy. Puddle. And go for a go swim. Get go get it. Lila, ew. Go jump in. Psych! <laughs> All right, let's go. I think this one was a bust. We're back again with our next geocache. So we didn't find the last one, did we? No. Nope. So this one is actually sponsored by a church, which we like. And uh, I guess it has something to do with the Ten Commandments. Because they said it's space. We've got honeysuckle over here. Um, Part of what they said was that it was across from, I don't know if you can see it, it says the East Texas Trophies. And what they were saying is that how people often make idols of other things, shiny things, kind of like they did back in the Bible days, and uh, graven images or money or status. And so we're looking for this. I really don't think it's going to be this shoe here. But you never know. I saw a gecko or something over there. You saw a what? A gecko or something. There. A gecko? Ew. Are we in the rainforest? No. We better watch out. There might be some anacondas. They said it's watch out for vines, so we're assuming it's out there. Well, these are all vining plants. So it's got to be somewhere in here, but it didn't act like it was going to be deep into it. But you never know. And there are some things we're just not willing to walk into. Like this. We can't see where we walk, so we might run into poison ivy. <gasps> poison. We see a bird. Abigail's excited about the bird. Right Don't it. touch the nasty shoe. Maybe it's in the shoe. Yeah, maybe. Is it? No. Don't touch it! Mm -hmm. Ew! That's nasty! Hey Lila, come here. Come here Lila. Come here. Abigail, come here. Come here. Look. Ew. Poo emoji! Poo emoji! Poo emoji! I thought y'all liked the poo emoji. That's fine. You don't want to take that home with us? You don't want to take that home with us? No. Oh, come on, just touch it. It's so soft. How do you know? It might be in there for like a year. Well, it's wet. It rained. So it gave the clue of look at the base of the tree. But if you notice all around here, all this greenery, it's covered with poison ivy. So we're going to have to say that this geocache, yet another one, is a bust. Unless your treasure is in poo. There's lots of poop everywhere. Uh, that's nasty. Everybody, you're probably wondering, why are you doing this crap? Oh, it's fantastic. It's so much fun. You get to get out in the in the eventful uh, weather, and and you get to spend time with your family and do things that that really matter. So that's why we do it. Yeah, we're probably wasting a bunch of gas, but it's okay. Here we go now. We are going to find this one. We have had some terrible, terrible luck. But we're going to find this one. 
I bet you it's in this tree. Wow. There's something. What is that? What is that? There's something in there, Abigail. You want me to grab it? Yeah, grab it. Hopefully it's not a snake. It's not a snake. I'm just playing. What is it? Grab it. Is that it? I don't know. Is that it? I don't know. Open it. Guys! Open it. Guys! What is it? Is it it? What is it? I don't know. You might check and see what's in That's it's it. Snake. That's it. Found you found it. it. You found it. You found it. Found it. Found it. No, found maybe it. she found it. That's called a wait for a tire. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was a knife. Nope. Nice try though. I do. Well, it's in my hat. It was over here. It's in my hat. I got it right here. Here you go. Here. You hold it the pin. It come out. I'll get it. Hold on. Chill out. I got it. I got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. Got it. You got it. It's all green and moldy. Yeah. Ew. Doesn't that tree? Ew. It's in the middle Ew. of the tree. Ew. Scratch me. There, I'll hold this. Look how little it is. No. You can stick it in my nose. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it fits in my nose. Ooh, it fits in wet. both nostrils. See, look, it goes in the other one too. Hey, you want to hold it now? It had no. boogers on it. No. Hey, Lala, Lala, burp. I want to hear you burp. Do a burp. Let me hear. That was weak. Do a burp. Come, oh, come on. It's fairly terrible. <laughs> Mama, Mama, do a burp. I already did like three minutes ago. Well, I didn't hear it. Well, they didn't hear it. No, I'm yeah. missing. Come on. Come I'm on. Sure you need to redo, Lila. That was weak. I know you can do better than that. Come on, one more good one. Good one. Good one. <laughs> Turtle burp. That <laughs> eh, was okay. <laughs> oh, holy <laughs> cow. That's a Wonder Woman burp. That's yeah. why she got the shirt on today. <laughs> you think stuff's bouncing on her, dripping on her, bird it. poop on her? And I can't get it. What? Did you burp again? Do it again. Oh, that was terrible. Oh, I'm hurting your chair. I made it too. I didn't roll it quite Oh, out. That wasn't me, I promise. Here, you hold everything else so I can roll it tight. Oh, she's rolling something. We found it in this little tube in that, that tree dad, right there. That he that put it tree in his right nose. there. That my dad put it in his nose. I put it in my nose. Yes, so I put it careful. in my nose. So be careful when so you touch it. So people out there, if you come to this one, hopefully it rains since then. Yes. Because it'll wash all the boogies off of it. Yes. Yeah. He put it in But his we nose found right one here. finally. Meanwhile, Daddy's going to get three. the flu virus. I'm not going to. I'm going to get the some it's, kind of flu virus gonna maybe. He's going to get poison ivy up his nose. Maybe it's been in the tree for about At least one we year. finally found one. What if it's been in the tree for one year? This was a good one. Well, we found we had uh, some bad luck. We found the cemetery. So, so oh, we're yeah, good we now. Did find the we did the cemetery. The what? The cemetery. The cemetery. The cemetery one. All right. Okay. Let's move on to the next Guys, one. We have arrived at one that has said that they have discontinued the geocache here, but we wanted to check it out anyway. Check out this cool place. Beautiful little park, beautiful little fountain and walking area and everything. So we wanted to share this with all you folks out there. And Getting a little screenshot here. But yeah, yeah we a wanted to little check this place out. Little teddy bears over there. A cute little place we wanted to just share with you guys. And kids playing. They're not moving very fast though. I don't know what's the deal here. Why aren't they moving? They're stuck. They're metal. I think they're stuck. They're metal. They get stuck? They're metal. They're metal. Yeah. That's they're weird. Metal. <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> You're weird. <laughs> that this is a special needs way. Yeah. That's us, we're special needs. We are not special needs. Our mom works for the special know. needs, but I think we're your not mom thinks needs. I am though. We're not special I'm, needs. I'm, but our mom works. There's some more kids. A big Giant teddy bear that's the first thing the other one. This is a pretty baby. place. And a little baby girl. A little bench over there you can sit on and enjoy the scenery. It's a little bridge. See the little waterfall in the background? Coolness.
cool little waterfall fountain. Just thought we'd want to share this with you guys. Awesome stuff. Check this prettiness out. Mosquitoes flying around me. Oh, I'll leave them alone. They don't eat too much. <laughs> Wonder Woman. I didn't get one down the way. Alright, guys, we made it home finally. Big eventful day. Thanks for hanging with us on doing all the geocaching and, and just having fun and goofing off and. But uh, don't forget to leave a like and make sure you subscribe before you leave. Uh, just bear with us and, and come along with the ride and have fun with us. And thanks for enjoying the videos and, and keep them coming. We'll see you later.